welcome to our first week of our monthly calendar, our first full week. So hopefully you got your assessments done and we can move on to our mental movement week. It's starting with setting and SMART goals. So SMART goals are specific, measurable, attainable, relevant, and time-bound goals. Um, and to go along with the post that I made earlier today, um, I said that I was sticking with number one for positive, positive thoughts, say something nice to yourself, um, to help improve my mental health. So you can go through that list, make something from that, or select and come up with a goal for a whole other aspect of your life, whatever you want to do. Um, I am, I definitely need to improve my self-talk. I am the meanest person I know to myself and I I, I can say really mean things, like things that, like I don't even know how I come up with such terrible insults. Um, so they're definitely not something that I would ever say to a friend or a loved one and it's definitely, they're definitely not things that I should say to myself or about myself um, because it's not, it's not nice. Um, what you say, like words are powerful things. If you say them, um, it can happen. You can start to believe it and I need to stop being mean. Um, uh, yeah, I'm like a middle school, high school girl to myself. Like it's, it's mean. So we're going to stop. Um, I have already started my goal for the month. So I am going to be doing a positive affirmation meditation every single morning. So basically, um, it's just nice, positive things that... I get to say to myself for five minutes um, and uh, that is what I will be doing so specifically it is a self-love affirmation on my insight timer app that I'm going to be listening to every morning for the month of May so when my alarm clock goes off on my phone I am going to switch it over to the app and start playing that um, I'm going through my SMART goals here. So measurable, um, you want to be able to measure your goals. So because my goal is to do this every day for the month of May, I have a printed off calendar where I have put X marks. Um, it's gonna be up by the side of my bed so that I see it every morning. Um, and if I don't think of it first thing, I'll see it um, right when I get out of bed. Uh, and will remember to do that. So measuring it in the sense of checking off every single day that I do that. Um, attainable, it's attainable because it's five minutes. It's, I'm already in bed, that's good to go. Relevant, um, I need to improve my self talk, talk, so reinforce my self worth. And by listening to these five minutes of positive things, um, it will hopefully help, help me do that. And then time bound, it's time bound for the month of May. That's the amount of time that I'm going to do it at. One other or two things to go along with the goal setting is it helps if you, it helps one to just start small. So I just need to do five minutes of this. I'm not saying 20 minutes. I'm not saying 30 minute break, focus on this. No, five minutes, that's all I have to do. So start, start small and then attach it to something that you already have going on. In the mornings, I already reach, wake up and reach for my phone. So that is, that's what I'm doing. I'm attaching it to that habit that I have already created. Um, and then plan, try to plan for an obstacle that you see might be getting in the way with this goal. The more that you can plan for them, the more that you can overcome them. So. Already, I know that I'm a little bit of a procrastinator, so probably might ignore that alarm a time or two, um, hit snooze. I do have to clock in for work every morning at 8 a.m., so um, that might not 
work out for me if I like if I lose that five minutes so my backup plans for that are to listen to the meditation when I'm in the shower if I take a shower that day otherwise um, listen to it before bed so I will probably have to set a reminder to listen to that meditation before bed so I don't forget we usually listen to a bedtime meditation anyway so I would just sneak that one in before we start our baby bird nighttime meditation so that is what I am doing for this month for my smart goals your challenge is to also create a goal whether it's long term or short short term and come up with the specifics of that so if you need help let me know I can help um, help you kind of determine or set some boundaries or come up with some plans for overcoming those obstacles or figuring out how you want to attach your goal to a habit that you already have to create a long longer lasting habit so anything like that let me know and tomorrow I believe we have a nature's challenge so stay tuned for that